afternoon, Surgeon community. I'm Sarah McGlinchey, Content Marketing Manager for Surgeon and Surgeon CPA Review. And today I'm joined by Mandy Bradley. Mandy is a CPA of nine years, and she's a partner at Davis and Hodgden up in Rutland and Williston, Vermont. And Mandy, I'm here today to talk to you for some of our listeners about uh, really, uh, you know, it's that time of year where college seniors are contemplating taking the CPA exam, and they may be hesitant given the amount of time, investment, and um, maybe, you know, a monetary investment as well, and just maybe they're on the fence about taking the exam. And so I wanted to talk to you as a current CPA about uh, why you decided to become a CPA. Well, thank you, Sarah. I appreciate the opportunity. And one of the biggest things that I would say, um, the reason that I took it is that first, I didn't actually know what I was going to do after college um, until a professor started talking about the CPA exam. And um, I really didn't know at the time the opportunities that it would open up for me. Um, one thing is, even if you're not interested in going into public accounting, having that um, accreditation after your name when you're going to interview for other jobs, I certainly think gives you the upper hand against other candidates that you may be going against. And you can always start out in public accounting, uh, take the CPA exam, and, and decide whether it's for you. And, and I still think it's a great opportunity, even if you go to private accounting, to have that accreditation and experience behind your name. Um, and I certainly think that, you know, it gives you a, a the opportunity for a better pay scale, you know, with that, uh, whether you, again, public or private, it's just something that has proven that you've worked hard and, um, you know, committed to your profession and, and what you're looking for to, to do with your career. Great. Well, thank you so much. And as far as your profession, what would you say um, is most rewarding about your profession as a CPA? Sure. Um, you know, I think some of it might sound a little funny to students, um, and, and I probably would have thought the same if I was in their shoes, but but just coming out of a tax season, uh, one of the things that I look at is the accomplishment. Uh, things are very fast paced, but it's an incredible team environment. Um, you know, working with your, your peers and you also spend a tremendous amount of time getting to know your clients and their businesses and what they're looking for in your services. And you really accomplish a lot during that time period. Um, yes, it's a lot of work, but you know, it's one of those things where once you're done, you're like, wow, you know, we really hit some milestones and some goals and really helped our clients with their uh, needs for their businesses and um, saving taxes, of course. <laughs> saving taxes is most important. You get to be that's a hero. Right. That's right. That's right. So, um, and just one final question for you here. So for our listeners who are contemplating the CPA exam and Still, still a little intimidated by it. Um, just to ask you, being on the other side, would you, given the chance, take it again? Uh, I, would, the choice? I would take it again, although I, my biggest um, point is that I'm glad I took it when I did, which was right after school. I was used to spending my time doing studying. Um, you know, it was just something coming from graduate school that I was accustomed to doing, although fast forward, um, you know, five, six years, I have a lot more activities after work and, and volunteering and or um, trying to get new accreditations for work. So I have that time to do those things, whereas I have seen some people struggle doing it, you know, when they waited a little while to go back, but it's not impossible by any means. Uh, my biggest piece of advice is is give yourself the time to study for it, you know, really allocate that and um, you got to be determined. And I think that's important, but I would do it absolutely what it's done for my career and the opportunities that I've had. I would absolutely do it again. And, and I think it's well worth your time and effort. Great. Well, thank you so much, Mandy Bradley, for your time today, um, speaking to our listeners, particu particularly our graduates. Um, this interview will actually be posted to our blog. Surgeon CPA Reviews blog is called Passing Insights for folks um, hoping to pass the CPA exam. And Mandy, again, thank you so much for the advice you have uh, for our aspiring CPA candidates. All right. Thank you, Sarah. We appreciate the opportunity.